Welcome yogis. We're going to do a 10 minute seated yoga set in our chair. Please have both feet connected fully to the ground. If your feet cannot reach the ground in the chair you're in, grab yoga blocks, grab a board game, grab books, stack something under those feet so that they are touching the floor. As best you can, having the legs in 90 degree angle, as best you can. Your sits bones, I'd like them if possible towards the edge of that front of your seat for the movements we'll be doing. I don't want you to fall out of your seat, so somewhere towards the front of your seat. Neutral spine, we do not want you slumped in your chair. We do that enough throughout the day, right? So go ahead and get into your seated posture. I do want to point out that these uh, videos are often for patients like myself with an elbow injury or complex regional pain syndrome. So if you have restrictions based on what your provider, your surgeon, your pain specialist, your occupational therapist, your physical therapist, someone on your care team, if they've given you a restriction for something that you should not or could not or cannot do, please listen to the restrictions you've been placed with. And we are going to stretch both sides of the body. So uh, my limited side is here on my left. And by doing yoga and Qigong movements, I have increased range of motion, decreased pain, and I just feel much more normal and well in my own body. However, I also do my stretching on the right side because my limited side cannot do everything. And so my right side is lifting and pulling and pushing and getting lots of overuse. So we are going to stretch the neck, the shoulders, the back, and do some quick things for the bottom of the body. That being said, let us begin. So inhale, gaze up towards the sky. Exhale, chin to chest. Inhale, gazing up to the sky. Exhale, chin coming down to chest. Make sure your shoulders are relaxed. Inhale up, those shoulders stay down as your gaze floats up. And exhale, chin to chest. Coming back to neutral. Inhale, looking over one shoulder. Exhale, coming to neutral. Inhale, other side. Exhale, center. Inhale. Exhale, center. Inhale, turn. And exhale, center. Last time. Inhale. Exhale, center. Inhale, turning. And exhale, center. Let's go and shrug those shoulders up towards the ears and exhale, slide them down the back. Inhale, shrugging shoulders up to the ears, exhaling down the back. Inhale up, exhale down the back. Let's switch directions. So inhale, the shoulders are coming forward, exhale, they're sliding down. Inhale up and forward, exhale down and back. Last time, inhale up and forward and exhale to a neutral spine. Great job, yogis. Let's shake it out. Shake out our fingers, shake out at the wrists, up and down, side to side as best you can. Flip them over, palms facing up, shaking. And let's go ahead and go palms towards shoulders, bending at the elbow. Again, doing the best you can on either side of your body. Let's go ahead and open up the arms and do the same thing. So again, as best you can with the range of motion you have today, hands are coming out to the side and hands are coming up towards the shoulders. Doing it on both sides, getting there closer each day. Good job. Bring your hands down to the side. Let's go ahead and do one for the spine here. So let's bring our hands in a loose fist. 
Bent at your elbows, arms are open. Exhale, curving the back, chin to chest. Inhale, open, chest lifts. There's a back bend. Exhale, belly button to spine, chin to chest. So, seeing it from the side. Inhale, opening up, back bend, chest lifts, head lifts, arms open wide. Exhale, the spine rounds, the belly button comes towards the spine, chin towards your chest. Inhale, opening. Exhale, rounding. Go ahead and do two more at your own pace. Okay, when you've come to the rounded back, go ahead and bring your hands back towards your thighs or your hips, coming into your neutral spine. Let's have our hands at our hips, and we will do a C curve left and right to twist the spine side to side. So lifting up with your right hand towards the sky on your inhale, and exhaling over towards your left. Inhale, the right arm comes up. Exhale, bring it down. Inhale, the left arm comes up, reaching towards the sky. Exhale, bending to the right. Inhale, bring the arm back up towards the sky and exhale, bringing it down. Two more times each side. So inhaling up and exhaling to the left. Inhaling the right arm up. Exhaling that right arm down. Inhale, the left arm up. Exhale, you're leaning to the right. Inhale, that left arm up. Exhaling, bring the left arm down. At your own pace. Breathing. Feeling the stretch. Continuing to breathe. Good. When you're done, go ahead and bring your hands back to your hips or your thighs. We're going to do a twist. So inhale, lift, getting tall on your sits bones. And exhale the left hand to the outer right thigh. You're twisting towards your right shoulder. Inhale, lengthening. And exhale, twisting to the right. Inhale, lift. And exhale, twist. Slowly unwinding, continuing to breathe back to neutral. Going the other direction. So inhale, lifting tall, exhale the right hand to the outer side of the left thigh, twisting to the left, inhale, getting tall, exhale, twisting to the left, inhale, lengthen, exhale, twist. Go ahead and slowly unwind back to neutral. Great job, yogis. Let's do some movements for the lower half before we begin to wrap up. So sitting firmly on your sits bones, grounding through your root, lifting up one foot, pointing and flexing the toes. In and out with the toes, point and flex, keeping strong in your spine, continuing to breathe into your body. And go ahead and rotate at the ankle one direction. Doing the best you can, keep breathing. And at the other direction, give your ankle a rotation the other way. Crack and crunch as you go, breathing. Go ahead and bend at the knee, kicking in and out, up and down with the bottom half of your leg. Feeling that burn in your thigh, breathing into the body. 
Great job, yogis. Let's switch to the other side, lifting the other leg up, pointing and flexing at the toes, breathing into the back of the body. Go ahead and rotate your foot one direction at the ankle. Keep breathing. Go the other direction. Great job, yogis. And the final movement, getting some movement, bending at the knee, lifting that lower part of the body up and down as you breathe. Great job, everybody. Okay, before we close up, let's just do a forward fold. So sit back in your chair a bit more. I don't want anyone to fall out of their chairs. Again, listening to your body, following your own restrictions, doing what you can. So knees can come out wider than the hips. Feet are still planted on the floor. So let's inhale up, slight back bend as the arms come up overhead, and exhale, hinging at our hips, forward folding. Breathing here for a few moments. Nod your head yes. Shake your head no. Go ahead and roll up, slowly coming back up to your seat. We'll do that two more times. Arms lifting up towards the sky, slight back bend as you inhale, and exhale, hinging at your hips, coming forward as best you can, shaking your head yes, shaking your head no, and coming back up, rolling up at the body, coming up to a neutral spine, Last time at your own pace, inhaling the arms up. Slight back bend if you choose, and exhaling the arms forward. Nodding yes, releasing that neck, shaking your head no. And slowly rolling up, coming back to neutral. Excellent job, yogis. Let's finish strong together. Inhale, arms out to the side, reaching up, touching your palms or whatever can come together. Exhaling, heart center. Inhale, arms out wide, up to the sky. Exhaling, arms coming down in gratitude. Inhaling, arms up, out, wide, up to the sky, palms or wherever they will touch. Exhaling those arms down, hands coming together at heart center in front of your body. Thank you for practicing with me. The light in me honors the light in each and every one of you. Namaste.